story of the movies, The Project Omega, Episode 2, The Flash Armageddon. Not gonna lie, it was really fun watching this. It's this about the Flash, Barry Allen, who gets a visit from a villain from the from their future, but on the same planet. His name is. Desperado, or however you pronounce it, and he wants to kill the Flash to prevent Armageddon. You see, the Flash calls in a bunch of different heroes to help him, and the Flash wants Black Lightning to take away his powers. He also gets help from the Adam, the Ray Palmer version, and Barry make, uh, tells, wants Joe to whoop up some food, but Barry doesn't remember any of this, but Joe is dead, and he has been for six months, and then Despero tries to kill him, but Barry gets away. And Barry and Dion, the Still Force, helps Iris stay between timelines. And Dion realizes Joe wasn't supposed to die, and so they helped. They helped Barry run away from this. This part of, I can't say his name. I'm not gonna even try but Barry later he finds out that in the future reverse flash is the one who uh, who messes everything up and creates Armageddon but in this timeline Barry is the first Flash and Thawne is the Flash. And so Barry has until midnight or else he disappears. But Barry manages to team up with Damian Dark. Also in this timeline, Cisco is dead, Ray Palmer and the Legends of Taparo are dead in this timeline. And Let's see, what else? And then Mia Queen comes along and she's looking for her brother. And basically, that's about it for Armageddon. Barry saves the timeline. He also saves Thawne by removing the negative speed force from him. And therefore creating a timeline co collapse because at the end of Armageddon we're seeing a picture of 2014 the day Barry got struck by lightning and his kids Bart and Nora somehow caused the timeline to screw up the end next time on the project Omega. It is episode 3, and I have a guest, and it's The Matrix Resurrections. Until next time, stay safe and peace.